Hello and welcome back to Railway Empire, where we've got a lot to do, haven't we? We've got a lot of uh, new lines, to, well not new lines, existing lines that need a, a, new, a new route planning for us. As you can see, we're playing straight away because I want to get straight into this and get everything built. Missing equipment. This is going to always be an issue for us until we get our maintenance yard in up here. Which is going to serve us quite well, given the spaghetti mess that we have currently going on. And we'll get it looking something more like that. Which, uh, once you thread them through maintenance stations, you get a lot more options. Spy succeeded! There we go. Lovely. What did you, what did we get? Speedometer received. Oh, we need to look at that. That's wonderful. We saw that at the end of the previous episode, didn't we? Uh, which one's that? Speedometer. Speedometer, is it this? No, it might be in the other one. Maybe it's back in this one? Ah, there it is, guys. Yeah, it's gone back in here. So this was a 300-point unlock for us that gives all of our locomotives 5% increased power, which is going to be wonderful. And uh, we'll take a stoker, why not? Right, should we get on with uh, redirecting our trains now? Because we need to make use of the new layout. Our Stockholm trains have now taken this line once more. However, we need to get a rough idea of where they're heading. They're reutilizing the new waypoints, are they? No, they're existing waypoints, so they were still using those. We deleted those ones. We could put them in there again, but it looks like they're behaving. We actually want them to go, do we? I guess we could have them going out that way. It doesn't really matter that, I mean, that would save a lot of messing around. They're doing okay, as is. I like the split bit here. Do you know what? Not required then. Except for maybe here is a bit weird. And we could get them on this track. Right, so after that waypoint, could you go on there? And then after, no, is that the wrong one? That might be the wrong one. It's after that waypoint. Could you go on there? There we go. That's better. And then after Gothenburg, could you go on there? There we go. And after Stockholm, it would be after this waypoint. Could you go there? There we go, guys. We've separated them further. We've got to copy that across to all of the others, unfortunately. But we'll accept that one and then we'll just copy it and then i'll go through and do it to all of these insert rail line done all right guys i've gone ahead and done that for all of our trains that are on that line as you can see it's making the changes as we go okay let's think about what we're doing next what trains do we actually have running down here we could pull away well the fishing one is going to have to stay there these are okay to stay there. We want to thread out these ones. The more local trains. So what we'll do is we'll adjust this. And instead of Stockholm 1, we're going to go on Stockholm 2. So after that, and then we'll delete that. That should be fine, as is. Yeah, now you go in that way. That is perfect. We'll accept that one. Have we got any others that we don't want to do that? These, this one here. And then we're pretty much spread out, aren't we? Well, this one as well. What are you doing? You are going through there. That is fine. We probably want to look at having a direct line as well, don't we? Yeah, we should connect this up as I forgot to do that. Well, that one's fine. Let's leave that as is. I need to connect this back up. And that would be running from here. And we're going to be going round the back but then direct into the uh, into here. And I believe it should only need to be single track because we can get rid of that signal. I don't think we'll... No, we won't need another train, will we? We will need a supply tower here. We will need a one-way signal just there. We can delete that one. And then we're good. And then we're only using this platform here. So that's our new single line train just there. Logging to the warehouse. Yeah, this is the one we've got to change. There we go. It's done it automatically. That is brilliant. We don't have to worry about it. Like I said, they're eventually going to figure out themselves what to do. 
we have nothing using this at the moment. So that's okay. These are just using these. Do we have anything using that? No. Let's get us another train, but this time we can go from the warehouse straight into Stockholm 2, avoiding the express line and the fish cross over. And there we go. Stoker, I'm sure, <laughs> will get you on there. Now we have a, another train operating from the warehouse into Stockholm, which is going to need a maintenance yard on there. We need to sort out this finally and address that situation. How are we doing over here? Well, these need upgrading before it's going to affect us. So that's going to cost us an arm and a leg. But there you go. Probably concentrate on, on the pigs first and the sausages. That's good. Are these guys down here getting potatoes? That's my question. No, you're not. Do we want to run that way or do we want some way to come in this way and head down and branch off and head round and in the back there? Because there's not much going on, is there? I mean, what would be what would be quicker? I mean, it doesn't really matter, does it? We've got plenty of options either way. It's just a, the old train to uh, deliver potatoes or vegetables. There we go. We'll just send them down like that with uh, freight only. There we go, guys. We're in. Now, we should hook up Karlstad and get us what we need in here, which would be a distillery, right? That's what we decided on, and hook up that as a passenger line. We're going to do this out the way down here, and we're going to put in our first train station here, finally. So this is going to have... We're going to go with just a normal one. Oh, you can't build there yet, you burk. <laughs> we don't have access, do we? It's fine, we've, we've already bought it. And they're technically going to use it immediately from here. Okay, I got ahead of myself. It's all okay. It's not though, is it? No, you made a mistake, Grand, admit it. Anyway, oh, here's something we haven't done. We haven't hooked up this warehouse up to uh, Westeros, our main, our main station. We could continue up this way. We've got to avoid all this uh, shenanigans going on over here but we can cross just there uh, maybe this bit isn't needed yeah that's better and then we can uh, slide in up to here now i'm gonna say oh that's steep isn't it that's super steep you know what we'll get rid of this do you know what there's needed here don't you we need a better junction we really do that is awful uh yes could we Head up here and have uh, a triangle or a Y junction just here and head into the uh, southern platforms of both of these from this warehouse rather than taking them round here and getting in the way of everything there. Then we can move these to the side. Do you know, I like that idea, guys. We're going to reset this train and then we can utilize the same bit of track and avoid crossing up here. We can always do something different. Uh, with this section that we had before and maybe branch off and direct into here should we ever uh, need it since we're going to be crossing over this river it makes a lot of sense it almost looks shorter to me as well a shorter distance so we could like instead head up this way utilize that head up here and then we should be able to scoot over there and then we're going to be heading this way. We've got to join in with that iron mine at some point. Right. And then yours just stopping there. We're going to remove this that's been here since day one. Yeah, we're going to reset all our trains. I'd rather do this now than later. We're going to redo this junction. This is not going to be like that any longer. We need to reset all of our trains as well. We're going to add a new station here. It's all go, guys. It's all go. We're redoing everything. We may come across a few issues later on, but we can sort them easily. I mean, hopefully we spot them beforehand. This will help us for uh, passing trains through as well, uh, through Westeros. It'll also help us with uh, connecting to here and not having to go on this junction. So we're going to have lots and lots of options. Which means this is going to be connecting 
Oh yeah, should we put the, uh, let's put, where do we want this? I would say maintenance yard here somewhere would be nice. One there, we could have one here possibly as well. Just in case our trains don't make it, which means this can head in to this side like that and branch out and go down to that oh i've gone the wrong way it's fine it's fine i do that all the time delete that we want this on the outside like so yes you enter there you are going in this way now and into this center line is that right yes you are just like that from here we're going to be branching that way and into this end part there and there we go we've got a, a bit better a bit cleaner access on there let's get all this signaled up it's a monstrous junction now right you're going in there beautiful that's smoother i like it this is going to be connecting up into here so that's perfect Right, we can delete this back and reconnect it straight from the farm. Uh, is it a farm? Yes, it's the grain farm, isn't it? And you are going to be going directly up to the farm like so. There we go. Lovely. In fact, this has a lot of traffic. Should we actually upgrade it to uh, signal controlled? I mean, we can afford it, right? Yes, you're going to have to set up, reset all those. We need just a a normal train station like so there. Because we're going to send some up north as well. And you're going to be going that way into there. Now what we have the option to do from this point is have another another station here so we can bring in coal and even like supplement what we've got going on up that way. We can also send up logs direct and completely bypass this section uh, for now that's good enough now we've got more options you see this whole junction needs to go we need to get rid of this it's it's not very efficient at all is it no get rid of all of that you're not going to be needed any longer there we go get rid of that now i would like a yeah reset these please which might be handy, as some of these trains might be diverting. I would like a maintenance station here, or a junction control, just there. I would like one just there, and I would also like one just there. And this should be a pleasant connection for us. You have the main line running down here. This is going to give us so many automatic uh, maneuvers that will save a lot of stress later on once we've got it set up and running like clockwork we can forget about it i mean it was remnants of the beginning of the the scenario which was really quite difficult to get going but now it's starting to be beautiful if you can call rail roads beautiful which i certainly can i do like to call them beautiful now do we need this inside one I mean, I, not really, but we could do something like this and branch out like so. And then what you can do is have this one branch out that way. No, this one's going to branch out that way. This is just adding another option for us. If we need to filter our trains, if some lines are getting a little too busy. So we're going that way and then that way. That way and then that way and then this one is going to be heading up to here and then in like so so there's our main junction and then what we can do is create a bypass into here uh, we could even have another maintenance yard but what i'll do is just have a single piece of track that goes, oh, don't do that yet. <laughs> that runs up here and then just branches directly 
into this warehouse, uh, not warehouse, maintenance station. In fact, if we're going to do that, we could do the same thing, can't we? We can get rid of that section there and have it like this. So we don't have to worry about joining with the rest of the track. There we go. And then that way we come in separately as more of an express route, bypassing that warehouse. A maintenance that keep calling it a warehouse, why don't you? And then we're in. And this also gives us options to bypass off here or come in from this way as well. All of the options. Nice busy piece of track there. I love it. Do we like that? Excessive, possibly. Fun to do. For me. Maybe it's giving you some ideas though. I'm, I tend to go overboard when I'm recording. So I can give you like many ways that you could accomplish the same thing. And this is one way of doing it. This doesn't need to be this spaghetti mess at all, does it anymore? No. I mean, first off, this is direct connection into here. Like that. There we go. That's much nicer. Our main line is going to be heading up to our factories to the north. There we go. We can finally upgrade this, I think, quickly. Right, now, back to building. Before our trains panic. Now, what do we do here? We can actually have multiple ways to get in here now, couldn't we? Rather than this join... Well, it's going to have to join. It almost looks... Do you know what? We're going to make use of another maintenance yard. Just to control this junction. I mean, if they want to use it, they can. But for now, I, I just would like to uh, split that off into there. Like that. And then we can split this one off as a main line. Over there. And then we can come in. Because we've got a few more buildings, you see. Up there, we can come in that way if need be. Later on. I like it. There we go. Right, does that cover all bases? What it doesn't cover is this one here. Uh, to head down. Over here, I didn't think about that. Ooh, do you know what you could do? Cheeky. I've got a cheeky idea, guys. We could expand this. And we can do this. Around the back and in. And then they can head off whatever way they like. Do we like that? I do. And this is going to be like so. Yes, I love it. Right, this needs to come around here and into there. You will have a line. Do we need to come in there? No, we don't need to come in that side because we can go direct into there. So this will be double track up to that point oh guys we're in we're in it's looking good I'm, I'm all sorts of happy with how this is turning out uh, let's get everything signaled up make sure we've also got all of the uh, maintenance buildings on our stations although a lot of it is handled via dedicated buildings now that's going that way that's going that way there we go Guys, is that tidier? It's not done yet. I like this bit with the turnaround. Rather nice. Uh, we're not done here. We've got to uh, combine these two stations. So that's going there. In fact, we could we could leave something open, right? No, that's not needed. You're just going to combine the two stations. Ignore the grade. I really don't care about it. I half think it's lying at times. And we could leave this open in case we wanted to do something different down here. Even if it's a warehouse of some sort. We'll go across the bridge up to there. And then slide in like that. And that gives us a connection to that station as well. There we go. We'll leave that one spare in case we want some sort of warehouse. Alright, that's all the signalling done. We're all connected up. We're good to go, I think. No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, not, yeah, not done at all, eh? Right, we need to uh, branch these off. Do we have a connection here? We do, direct. 
Uh, so these can simply do this and in a Y shape and leave the inner platforms available. Although they're going to be taken up immediately by that one. So this is going to come up here and then split in a Y. And then this is going to come down and straight into there. Now we're, now we're looking in a better, better place. We weren't quite done, were we? No. And then we get to uh, re-hook up the warehouse, but on a dedicated line, which is beautiful now. I do like this idea. Could we have used a maintenance yard? Quite possibly. I mean, it might be needed at some point. Oh, what do you? What are we doing here? Uh, you're on the wrong side. That's what's going on there. That's fine though. We can get rid of the track up to that point, and then we come in from here, like so. Sorted. And up to the. Uh... Oh, we run out of money, Matt. Ah. That was a lot of building then, guys. If we ran out of money, that was a horrendous amount of money spent. Good. I like it. Money spent on infrastructure is money well spent. All right, there we go. We're probably going to need uh, a supply tower up here somewhere. I mean, yes, we could lay another maintenance yard, but I think we'll take it like it is. Now, we need to come across here, don't we, and branch off. This might be a little pricey. 8% grade? What's that all about? Are you kidding me right now? Why is that so high? Oh, there's, that's better. 1 and 3. We'll take that instead. How much is that going to cost to hook up? More than what we've got, probably. Or exactly what we've got. Almost. Not quite exactly. There and there. Get rid of the Erinus signals. Well, they're not Erinus. They're just superfluous. Yes, there we go. <laughs> we don't need them, do they? Do we? Right, we need to save up for a, a tower just here. Several trains. Yeah, you're all, you're all panicking now. It's fine. We'll sort out any issues, but I think everything is connected. I can't see any issues now. We can go around the back there. There we go, to Westeros. Security guard, sure. I mean, that will take. Security guard, we have an engineer as well. Absolutely. Security guard, conductor. Do we have a conductor that could go down here, perhaps? Uh, yeah, oh, look at this. Urubro to Stockholm. They're beginning to take steel. Because of the fish. Guys, they're already making the fish. With great satisfaction, oh, we've done it. I am able to announce a tremendous increase in passenger traffic. Oh, now, even remote it. parts of the country are able to profit from the railway. I would like to call this an advantage of national organization. This is not all about the transport of passengers, of course. Wherever tracks are laid, industry shall rise soon. So, take care of the upcoming tasks quickly. Okay, guys, new tasks. I was not expecting that. We, I guess everything got sorted out. We do not have to worry about that any longer, the passenger lines. Although, I'm still going to continue. And fortunately, we have this one here, which is Connect 30 Rural Businesses to your rail network. Given what we're doing around our current area, we are connecting up more and more businesses. This is the one we were kind of ex half expecting, or I was, and that is furniture to Gothenburg and that stuff to there. <laughs> well, well, well played. You played it off well. Now, we've also got um, a lot of points to spend. Hold your horses game. We're busy. Now, I'm going to say more power for locomotives. Anything that makes our trains faster uh, has got to be a good thing. Well, we also got a promoter, was that? Yeah, uh, let's go into here. What do you do? Uh, promote a town. I mean, maybe it might be a bit of a waste of money at the moment. Nothing's growing, is it? Stock the Stockholm might. Let's not get distracted. We need to think about this now, this whole situation, about getting goods down here. Does this mean we have any more areas that we can buy? Small land. That's what I'm going with. 
which will bring into play Vimmerby and all this new network we set up. Oh guys, it's almost perfect. A little too perfect, except we're broke currently. How long do we have? 1864, so four years on that one. And then five and then six. So it looks like furniture will be our priority. Young shopping has grown. Really? Well, you get yourself a museum in there. More points and more points. We, we're not in the situation to upgrade. Maybe we can do that one, though. Do you know what we can do once we buy this area, guys? They get their milk. Which they also get this as well, don't they? Which is one of the things we require. What city is that from? There we go. Down here. Which we already put in place. Yes, because they require it, don't they? We had a look at their export warehouse and it does require it. It's on the sea, which is why it's probably a, uh, an export. Yeah, we've already seen that. Don't need to keep telling us. Everything's growing. Funds are a little tight, mainly because we've got, a, we own a lot of industry. And uh, that's going to cost us because we're going to have to keep upgrading them. Yeah, you're on the decline, but we're going to get rid of your silly clothing factory that you shouldn't really have and give you something more beneficial. Yeah, some of these might go on the decline currently as all the trains are like snarled up. We don't have any signal in here, which is not going to help. Uh, let's get that done and in. There we go. That will release some more trains from up here. Let's make sure we've got maintenance buildings. As uh, we've been a bit a bit hectic. Oh, I couldn't afford them for the longest of times. Construct one there as well. We have one there. Beautiful. And how are we doing down here? All done there. And does our new station have one? Yes and yes. You do. You do. You do. Right, let's see if that uh, keeps things moving. Because the more they're dropping in here, the, the more they'll stock up uh, on their goods and keep them going over winter. We could set up warehouses eventually if ne need be. Uh, yes, we're going to be making use of that shortly. I know, spending your money again, Grand. Shall we see which train... Oh, there we go, look at them all using it now. This is that uh, exchange line which they should then... Where do they go then? Or they then use this line. Oh, it's beautiful. They're all just uh, mix and matching which lines they use. Anyone using the direct line? That one is. Uh, where are you going? Which one's this? Oh, it's the direct one. Yeah. I mean, I don't quite know what you're doing. Oh, you're going to... Wait. Oh, of course. Yes. This is when we were doing that weird pickup and drop off and uh, because we didn't have direct lines did we maybe we should change this and get rid of the farm and have that direct and go via here so like after Uppsala could you go via here and then after Westeros could you go via here and have it automatic why are you doing that wiggle because I bet you're you're picking the wrong station aren't you it will automatically turn around in here, so we're going to have to keep an eye on things like that. Uh, what we need is this to be two instead. So we add that station, and get rid of that one, and it should be much tidier. And a direct link, and we'll accept that. And we'll do something similar that way again. There we go. And have automatic. That one's using it already. And we'll get you on there. Uh, we'll put a security guard on, because it will be taking goods. Uh, will you get along? You do. And an engineer. Even better. Guys, there's a lovely little route set up. Right, now we need a direct train. Is that the only place they can get grain? Because I would like them now to take their grain direct. Grain direct. Call now. Yeah, we're going to need that. Uh, yes have we still got one of these or is that just named weird now yeah it's just named weird that's fine can we edit that name I think we can 
Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We'll set up a new line. It's going to go from the farm direct to Uppsala there. There we go. And it's taking the shortcut. Beautiful. Freight only. And now you are dedicated grain. Get yourself an engineer on there as well. It's a bit of a journey. You do have a maintenance station to pass by. Two of them. In fact, I mean, it almost looks like a direct link to come out of here, doesn't it? And, and head into there. I mean, it might be an idea at some point. Conductor. Do we have any trains on here that could use a conductor? Oh, you don't have one. Do you make everybody else happy? Well, they're indifferent. And given how many people are on that train, that's a bit nice, isn't it? Goodness me. Guys, it's beautiful. I am so happy right now. I would like to probably do something similar with this and split them up. But uh, we'll mess with that later. As we've got to head down here now, we've got all this set up. Hopefully it all just figures itself out. Do we have trains on here? Yeah, we have the, the farm and then we have the farm again. That's perfect. Okay, we've got to save up money to buy this area. I'd like to end the episode on that. Which it looks like we can. Promoter. Again, with the promoters. I just don't know who needs it. Maybe these guys. Or oh, they're on the rise. Oh, do you know? That might be handy. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Let's uh, get one of those promoters. It's 200. Well, yeah, we can do it. It begins with a K. What is it? Carl. Carl. That one. Yes. One there. Can they both do it at the same time? Just like super. It could if we wanted. Uh, that's the other one down here, isn't it? I believe that was on was on the rise as well. Do you know what? We'll do it. Because this is where we're going to be working. Just here. And we're going to do that in the next episode. If we can afford to do this before we go. Did maybe I put that on fast forward. Because I'd like to buy this area. Please. Come on. Come on. Can we afford it now? We're going to start off broke. We can. Guys, we've got it. We're in. Uh, I would like... That's crisp bread. Yes, that's fine. Uh, this one's sausages, which is fine. Vimabee is steel, which we already did. Because we have preemptively done all this. Does mean we can hook up the milk. We're going to have lots of uh, maintenance yards. I'll save this and we'll get on one of our trains. All right, guys, we're on the... Uh, I don't know what train this actually is. I think it's Uppsala to Westeros. The new one. That's what I'm guessing. Where are we heading now? I don't know. Are we filling up? I probably picked the... What? No, there we go. Yes, it is to Westeros too. It's the one we just did. Isn't that lovely? On its new journey, with all the maintenance yards, which are more like managed junctions with signal controlling, it's looking good. I'm excited for what's to come. We've got to build some furniture. And we've got to bring build, build some bronust. Make some. Yes, it's food, isn't it? Of sorts, I believe. I think so. Anyway, guys, I'll leave you with a short little trip on here. And uh, I'll see you next week where we'll get to making furniture galore. That's the first one. And connecting all the industries will be a passive thing we do. So until then... Take care.